Hey everyone, and welcome back to another episode of 2020 Flight Simmers. If this is your first time joining us here on the channel, I would love to welcome you and suggest you go down below, hit that subscribe button, tick that little bell, and smash that thumbs up button. You don't want to miss any of our future videos, and it lets us know we're doing a good job here at 2020 Flight Simmers. So this video is all about the Bravo Throttle Quadrant and the LED lights after Sim Update 5. What has happened? I've seen a couple questions in various posts and forums about their lights not working again after Sim Update 5. So we're going to talk a little bit about how to get those lights to work again. And All right, so we are back, and I am at Microsoft Flight Simulator main screen, so I've already loaded into Microsoft Flight Simulator, so that's the important thing. And this is my community folder. As you can see, I've already downloaded the AFC Bridge executable file. I've already ran that file, and it's already put the file in my community folder. The problem is, uh, when I start up Microsoft Flight Simulator, none of the lights still work even though that's in the community folder again I've seen many other people post about this so I figured I'd make a video on it here's the very simple way to handle this problem after you've booted into Microsoft Flight Simulator you're at your main screen open up your community folder go down to that AFC bridge double tap on that you're gonna see the bin file right here double tap on that and the top is the application file so you're going to double tap on that. Nothing is going to happen. It's important that Microsoft Flight Simulator is running. When you double tap on that, you run that application, you go to your world map, you load into your flight, you click fly, and voila, your lights are now working on your Bravo Throttle Quadrant. So if this video helped you, smash that thumbs up button. Let us know that the video worked for you. And again, if you have not subscribed yet, go down below and hit that subscribe button while you're there. I want to thank everybody for joining us here at 2020 Flight Simmers, and as always, keep the blue side up. We'll see you on the next one.